Here's the spiky ball. The spiky ball is a terrific tool to help you with self soft tissue mobilization techniques. Perhaps the most common reason we send this out to people is to work on their elbow and forearm for a problem more commonly known as tennis elbow, which would be lateral epicondylitis. You can use it literally anywhere, but these are the techniques that we typically recommend. Uh, the first one is simply just pressure. We think of level one, two, and three, simply meaning level one is where I have pressure with my other hand and I have people think about like it's a bar of soap and you're washing the entire area. Level two would be where you put the spiky ball down and you have downward pressure of your arm over those same tissues. So it would look something like that. Level three is just level two with additional pressure over the top. So I can go like that, then my other hand presses to add additional load on that. Keep in mind as I'm compressing that tissue, I can simply mash it basically uh, down or I can do a kind of a pin and move technique, meaning let's say that spot's kind of painful for me, so that's a spot that I wanna pay attention to. I can simply keep working on it like that or in addition to that, I can hold that and then I can move my wrist up and down, I can move my fingers or fingers and wrist together, sort of a pin and move over that area. All those are totally useful. Another one we use, we call scrubbing. And with scrubbing, what you're doing is essentially trying to move that layer of connective tissue that's above the muscle, but below the skin. It's called fascia. And so I'm gonna have a little downward pressure over the area that hurts. This area will be somewhere where you're gonna want. And now I put a little bit of pressure on there, and then because of that pressure and the shape of the spiky ball, I can essentially pull that tissue. So I can pull it sort of forward and back, in and out, circle one way, circle the other way. All of those are techniques that work, and you just sort of scrub, if you will, all of the surrounding tissues that are uncomfortable. When you scrub, it's gonna hurt a little bit. It should not feel awful. It should sort of feel hurts good. And if you make it worse, you were too hard. It should feel better, like immediately better. Like if you do one of these things and, and it feels kind of locked out or tight or just frankly painful, then you scrub and do your other things. Um, you should do afterwards and go, oh wow, that feels better to me. Or maybe you might need to resist finger extension or wrist extension to retest. But you should have some sense of this being beneficial to you, even after you only do it for a minute or two. So there's spiky ball as if you have tennis elbow, level one, two, three, and scrubbing.